Beavis the Cat and Bumpa Vetcher with your boy Jason Zablaga Rappa. All right, so we got Mac OS Sierra installed, and uh, I've showed you a few of the features that I like and dislike. Uh, you can take a look in the link in the description below or in the cards or wherever uh, for my last video where I cover those features. Excuse me. Uh, but anyway, so in this video, I want to show you how you can install or actually how you can tweak the um, Hey Siri command. Now, uh, if you had a chance to play with Mac OS Sierra, you know that Siri is one of the most prominent features on the new operating system, and I love it. I think it's intuitive. I think you can use it for, you know, just about anything. Um, and it's, it's just an extension of the whole, you know, Mac's, Mac OS experience. So um, I'm really digging it. But unlike with your Apple Watch, your iPad, or where's my phone? I don't know where my phone is, but anyway. I don't know what that means. If you like, I can search the web for, we are on Hey Siri Command. Now if you had to choose a clip Mac OS or you know that Siri is one of the most prominent features on the new operating system and I love it. I think it's into it as I think you can use it for. You know it's not anything, it's just an extension of the whole you know Mac's Net Quest experience. So I'm really, but unlike with your Apple Watch here. <laughs> okay, you cannot make this up. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so Siri, apparently, this is what I'm talking about. I had no idea where my phone was, but, you know, I said, hey, Siri, and my phone started listening, and it <laughs> it dictated and read back to me everything that I said for, like, I don't know, 10 seconds or so. But uh, that was funny. Anyway, the point is, is that that hands-free hey, Siri function, you can't get on your Mac. It's not a native thing. Even though you do have Siri, it doesn't have that hands-free thing, which you have on your watch, your iPad, or your iPhone. There was an article written and released on redmondpie.com, which I linked in the last video, and I'll link it here again, uh, showing you that there's a tweak to allow you to essentially have that hands-free Hey Siri feature. Uh, I have not done it yet, so I'm actually going to do it here. I'm going to walk you guys through it and see if it works, at least if it works for me. Here we go again. Siri, shut up. And uh, then you guys can try it out and see if you like it. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, just follow along with the instructions. Step one, go to uh, system preferences. So we're gonna go into the system preferences for Siri. And let's see, what do I have to do now? Uh, make sure that the checks box next to enable Siri is ticked to enable Siri on the Mac. As you might expect, this is an extremely important, yeah, okay, yeah. Step four, uh, once you have configured Siri to perform how you want it, such as having voice feedback, yeah, that's there, uh, turned on or off, or having Siri icon in menu bar, let's go to keyboard, let's go to dictation, all right, there we go. Now, next step, here, make sure the dictation is set on and use enhanced dictation option, and, okay. So this is on, enable dictation, use enhanced dictation, so make sure that that is checked. Okay, cool. Accessibility, and accessibility, where's dictation? All right, dictation. All right, now what? Keyword phrase option is ticked. In the text field underneath, you can add your own phrase that will serve, that will drive Siri to be invoked add hey in this box okay so hey in the same window click on the dictation command wait in the same window click on dictation commands button at the top followed by clicking the plus icon to create a new command so click this and click on the dictation command Clicking on the clicking on the plus icon to create a new command. Where do I find that? I don't see that anywhere. Ah, oh, here we go. All right, so done deal. This new command takes on three variables. Fill the options in as below. Okay, so when I say Siri. 
the application open let's see there's no option here for Siri um, let's see if I could just find the applications well, here she is let's see if I could do this there you go open Siri app and you're done. You can now invoke Siri without being seated in front of your Mac to perform all the Siri supported functions on the machine. Alright, so let's try it. Hey Siri! And of course, none of them, my watch picked it up. Alright, let's try it again. Now, Hey Siri has never been too responsive in the first place, so um, my lack of making it work may not be an indicator that it doesn't work, it just may mean that. I'm not doing it right. <laughs> hey Siri. There goes my phone. All right, let's try it. Hey Siri. Phone again. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. Gosh, there goes my phone. Um, you can now follow us. Uh, so, seems like. I'm not making it work. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. <laughs> hey Siri. <laughs> Siri. Any application? Open Siri. Done. And that should be it. Hey Siri. Okay, um, pretty much done. <laughs> uh, I don't know why it's not working. Uh, I followed everything to the letter. Um, oddly enough, my phone that never picks up whenever I say, hey Siri, was going nuts over here, uh, listening intently to me. So, and my watch too. Oddly enough, my iPad did not go off once, but my watch did and my phone did many times. Unfortunately, I don't know what the deal is, but on here, it looks like it wasn't able to recognize it. Now, you guys may have better luck than I do. As, as you know, I'm running a 2010 MacBook Pro, so the hardware is older. Um, I can't do things like, you know, use my Apple Watch to unlock the computer. So maybe that has something to do with why it's not working for me. Can you guys let me know if you guys follow these, these instructions? Uh, like I said, I have the link in the description below. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you are able to make it work. And if you are, let me know if I did something wrong. I don't know. Uh, but it's kind of sad because, again, it's, it's a novelty. But, you know, if I'm, you know, if I'm trying to get a recipe for something on the Internet and I'm like, you know, in the kitchen away from my MacBook Pro, I would like for Siri to be able to answer um, my request or whatever. So, I don't know guys, kinda sad, but it is what it is. So anyway, let me know what you think and let me know if it worked for you. I really wanna know. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Go ahead and like my video, it helps, it helps out the channel. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next time, in the next video. I do videos every week, hopefully, most likely. This is Jason the Bloggy Rapper, much love, God bless, and as always, Peace. And I hit paste, whatever it is that I copied from my phone or iPad, bam, there it is right there on my Mac. So that's pretty.